Hey what's going on guys, KovaMikeKNZ here, in this video we're gonna be handling pawn promotions but before that let me just fix a small error uh, I've made in the previous part so I don't really need to double this get move capture flag again instead I can just make use of this pre-initialized capture variable so if it is true that we go right over in here and that's it so uh, the next thing uh, in order to avoid this sort of an error again we can already uh, reference the uh, promoted piece so e in case if the promoted piece is not equal to zero which means it is equal to either rook bishop uh, either queen rook bishop or knight uh, regardless of color it means that we have uh, upon promotion actually so uh, that's uh, the exact way to distinguish uh, uh, that's the exact way how to keep uh, how to track the promotion uh, the pawn promotion. So here I just say handle pawn promotions, and I can say if promoted. So in this case, we actually need to do only two things. So the very first thing we need to erase the pawn from the target square. So remember, like this this part of this piece of code will move the pawn say from the seventh rank to the eighth rank in case of white pawn and um, so we need to uh, erase that pawn and also we need to set up a new piece uh, on a bit board uh, where so we would be using the promoted piece to index the bit boards in order to set the proper it either queen rook bishop or knight uh, to our chessboard so just try to set up a new piece so let's let's go step by step so the very first thing we actually need to uh, erase the pawn uh, from the target square from the target square and the next p uh, the next step is actually to set up promoted piece on um, chessboard and now how how to implement this so in order to um, actually set up the piece uh, we need to say pop bit and we're gonna pop the bit boards indexed by the either white or black pawn so I'm using the ternary operator here so in case if side is equal to white uh, I, I would be index, indexing bit boards by white pawn otherwise I would be indexing them by black pawn and I want to erase it from the target square okay and now in order to actually set the bit uh, as, uh, to, to the corresponding bit boards uh, I can simply say set bit and bit boards and now I can simply index the bit boards by the promoted piece promoted uh, well actually let's call this not promoted but promoted piece to give it more meaningful name so promoted piece here promoted piece here and promoted piece here okay and I want to set this again on the target square and save uh, let me just uh, get uh, just command this code out to show you the behavior of the program if we don't use this so I just want to alter the tricky position again and just to put a white pawn on the uh, seventh rank so uh, here just want to put a white pawn and let's see what's what's gonna be happening so yeah obviously we need to open the terminal in current work in direct directory and by typing make debug I want to build the source and if it compiles I want to run the BBC binary executable and yeah here we have uh, yeah this is the black uh, black pawn bit boards from the previous part so let's handle this slightly a bit so I just don't want to print any bit boards at the moment uh, I just want to print the board like this so what's happening now you see like see here it just uh, making four moves because we have up to four pawn promotions available and here captures but uh, pawn is not getting actually it's not actually getting promoted to um, it's not actually getting promoted to uh, to anything and that's the reason actually for the code that we've just written so let's uncommand this back and 
and I just want to say like so first uh, we want to pop the bit of, of the pawn so now it would be like pawn is disappearing so pawn is getting raised here from the target square like you see like it's getting raised and the second step is actually to set the appropriate piece on board so now it goes to queen to rook to bishop to knight so we're indexing our bit boards by the promoted piece and that's the way how we pick up the corresponding bit board we just uh, setting up a bit there and that's the way how we uh, add the new the newly promoted piece on the chessboard so this is quite pretty it simple elegant and kind of working and also let me just try to test this for black pieces as well to make sure that it works absolutely the same so if we just change the side here uh, if we just restore this position back like here and here just make a black pawn so now it would be uh, uh, okay so it, it needs to oh, okay hold on a sec it, it was almost there so let, let me try this again so we, we promoting 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 okay and yeah okay I could have also show you the how this looks like from the bitboard's perspective well I hope it's quite pretty clear with uh, uh, with the pawns so just disappearing but uh, you, you, you just trust me that the correspondent piece is simply appearing on board and it's literally now just to print the board to make sure this is actually happening but you can also play around with the code here you're just trying to print the bitboards for say white queens or rooks bishops etc it's seen like how the bit is appearing when the pawn is getting promoted well, okay guys so this is it from my side uh thanks for watching i uh, hope you learned something interesting out of this tutorial uh, until the next time and take care